In the United States of America alone, there are one billion uh, respiratory tract infections like common cold and flu every year. So it's a huge burden for the health system and of course very nasty for the individual as well. On average we're getting two to five colds a year, that's for adults. Seven to ten colds a year for children and infants. Anything one can do to reduce that impact is really important. The common cold is a result of infection by many different viruses. And due to the fact that there are so many different viruses, there is no one vaccine available against this. The Common Cold Center at Cardiff University was established in 1988. And it's a clinical research organization that conducts clinical trials on new treatments for colds and flu, particularly self-medication. We've uh, done two very large studies last year. The biggest one was on the herbal medicine, Echinacea. It's not often that we get such positive results. The special with Echinophorsa is that you can use it for prevention and treatment of acute respiratory tract infections. Common cold usually takes seven to 10 days to heal without any treatment. If you give Echina Forza, usually it's gone by day five. And you can reduce all the symptoms. The first, you get rid of the fever, quite often by day two. You get rid of the severe headache. Active ingredients of the drug will attack viruses and destroy them. We used to have a lot of colds in our family. There's always somebody with a cold. Children aren't off school at all now. They might have a slight cold, but it's nothing compared to what it was because they're taking Echinophorsa. Echinophorsa is a very safe drug. The um, incidence of adverse drug reactions is not higher in all the studies as in pl the placebo group. And um, there is no liver toxicity, there is no resistance at all because typically for a herbal medication, it's not only one active molecule, like in chemical drugs, it's dozens of active molecules. And it's very unlikely that uh, viruses um, develop resistance to all the active ingredients. So it's a bit like preventive as well as a support. And I do not know of any other agent which would actually work in that capacity. So you can take it all the time, but when it's required, it will actually help support the body. And if it's not required, then it won't have an action. I think that's brilliant.